Jackson Dowell makes sure the pump and tube aren't visible, but he remains diligent. Diagnosed with type 1 diabetes when he was 3 years old, Oklahoma Christian School star golfer has turned what could be a hindrance for many into a driving force on a golf course. Everyone has their own flaw, but I think you've got to let it be a motivation to you, Dowell said. Dowell became the Class 3A state champion as a sophomore Tuesday, shooting a third round one over par 71 to total 203 rounds. He also led OCS to its second straight team title. Monday, he was masterful with a 4 under par 66 and a 7 under par 63 the first two rounds at Trosper Golf Club. It was quickly apparent why he's committed to Oklahoma. And he did all of that while monitoring his blood sugar. He often used his brakes to check his levels on the pump he stuffed in his right pocket. Then he returned to striking the ball better than anyone else in the field. It's a thing that can hurt me, but I try not to let it, Dowell said. Dowell isn't the only member of his family to be diagnosed with type 1 diabetes. His twin sister Eden was recently diagnosed. His father, Matt, was diagnosed when he was 12 years old. He still played quarterback along with basketball and track at Hennessy High School. There's a million worse things to have, Jackson's mom Christy said. It's manageable, where so many other things are not. Jackson said he's talked with PGA golfer Scott Verplank about managing diabetes and golf at the same time. He's also drawn inspiration from former Oklahoma tight end Mark Andrews and NFL quarterback Jay Cutler. That made Monday's blistering heat a non-factor. Dowell is used to Oklahoma weather, but he also knows how to manage his blood sugar. His biggest concern was the course and making up for last year's 13-stroke loss to Christian Heritage star Logan McAllister, who is also headed to OU. Dowell basically put the title out of reach the first day. But the team title was in question until the final few holes. OCS entered the day with a 10-stroke lead. Chow was only able to trim it to 5, with freshman Drew Goodman finishing 2nd overall and McAllister finishing 3rd. But when Dowell sank his final pup Tuesday, OCS crowd erupted. He almost looked embarrassed as he waved. Through everything, he had led the way to two titles. He's a sophomore, but he's absolutely got the respect of the guys. OCS coach Tosh Hayes said. Golf is a hard enough game as it is and to have that other thing he has to do besides just play the game, the guys respect that.